The two Mega Pops challenge can be quite tricky for a lot of people, but let's take it to the extreme by using Quincy with it. That's not going to be hard enough, so we're going to be doing this on the expert map, Dark Castle 2. Coming in right here with Quincy to Mega Pop. But at least this time, Quincy, the P Brew won't give it Quincy more range. So I want to see, can we do this early game? There's like a certain way you had to do it, if I recall. But can I do it with Quincy like back here? It has to like seek to that one other green, right? Do I have to have Quincy farther back? Oh, okay. Will that beat those greens? Does it beat around the rest of round six? No. Do I have to do like a regular start then? I think I'm just doing because if I if I have to put it like there, I'd rather just do the NG dart start and then get Quincy a bit later. So let's see, let's go dart NG on last. And this should work. Quincy's really cheap. So unlike Rosalia, if you remember that, I should just be able to get it quite early. Um, I won't be able to beat round eight though. So I have to get longer range. And then that should just run right into it. Rosalia definitely needs a rework. Yeah, I still feel like she's a little weak. Um, perhaps... Well, I really think faster level XP. If you can get her just to level 20 in like a game of advanced chimps. So is that uh, one point like two five X multiplier? Then she'd be a lot stronger. I'm going to put Quincy about right. I think here's going to be good. I'm going to have him close to the track, but not too far away that. Uh, well, not too close that P brew will steal a bunch of stuff. I should be able to get him on round 10, though. Because I don't want Pebrew stealing too many pops. I'll have Pebrew kind of, like, more in the back, though. So, like, maybe right there. Let's put you on strong. Actually, last. So I can beat round 10. Space it out for... The NG. There we go. We got it. Now, should I just go strong now? I think strong will be the best. So first, I want to get um, Alchemist, but you need it as far back as possible so you won't be getting pops. That's kind of like a big thing, Alchemist getting pops. And if we get Village, then it will increase the range. So I want to get Alchemist, obviously, as early as possible, but I might just have to deal with it having a little bit more range than intended. Uh, that's kind of a big, annoying thing you have to deal with sometimes. I didn't think you know. Yeah, Ros Rosalie is definitely still weak. I know I did like a bunch of videos. You probably see like a bajillion. Is Rosalie a strong enough video? Let's see. We're gonna need pen. Um, this guy will probably become a foam. I'll put you on first now too. That should work out. I'll save this ability for round fifteen. So let's see. Use it now. There you go. Good. So you're gonna be you're actually you're gonna take o overtake and pop soon. Oh, interesting. But yeah, this guy will be stealing some pops. Not really too big of a deal though. You get 47k pops to be stolen, and you haven't even hit 1k. So you really can get quite a few stolen early game. Um, it looks like I will need to use level three here on round 18 so let's go like that take it all out nice that actually worked wow i set you to first earlier because i thought that would just be more effective but actually last is better interesting um so i still am gonna need a bit more cash for alk Alk is a bit pricey. Can I beat 22 and 23 with... Well, AMD is not really going to do anything right now. 
So yeah, that is kind of annoying. Ooh, what can I do then? This really brings my, uh... My, um, whatchamacallit. Going for the Alk buff way... Way late. So that's... It's gonna be... Alk buff's gonna be delayed a bit, but I think Heli will be worth it in this case. Um, I can use level 3 here. Okay, and we take out the camo. Let's lock you in place about here. And now for... Actually, we're probably going to need you for 25, do we? No, that just works. So for the LEDs, I'm hoping AMD will just work. If not, I can also buy a foam. That's going to be uh, overclock later anyway, so foam could work out well. So here, I'm definitely going to be needing to use my ability right about now. And then leads come out, and we'll have to see how leads treat us. I don't know. Never really paid attention to that. Okay. So is that in range? That is in range. And I can also get the ALK buff now. Then that cleans up nice. So now Quincy is quite a bit stronger. Let's move that uh, heli a little bit farther away for that. And now, what's next? Village, I guess. Also, I don't know what I was blabbering about, uh, Alk, having to buy Alk later than Village. Well, I, I never really went that route anyways, but I just realized I can just get Village not in range of Alk buff. So I guess that's not, that isn't an issue either way. But next course of action, I am going to want to save up for Peebrew at some point, so I can't go crazy, like, getting everything. But... I will need to keep in mind that the Pebrew save-up will happen. It's 51k. It's a lot cheaper than it was before, which is nice for two Mega Pops. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking our glue beforehand will be necessary. Also, of course, getting Stim because I need that for Pebrew. So let's see how we go. Let's get... Uh, should I get Stim now? The Pierce actually might be really nice on Stim. Stim normally won't really have much effect, but I think here it would be good. An A and D stack. I don't know what that would do. So let's see. I'm going to... I'm just going to use that early on the first wave. And... I think do this get foam now the 032 foam does actually slow balloons that come by which is really good unfortunately that doesn't do anything good for me here let's see I could do I could do this I think it's just with the the alk down times I would need the ability on the second wave to actually survive okay that's kind of weird but that can happen I don't have my ability up immediately for these leads on 37 though, which is kind of annoying. Is it good though? Might just be fine. Let's get my village up. So village right here. I'll get discount for the later upgrades, but I just need this to be able to survive here. So what, do I need you on strong for those camos then? It's a possibility. Alright, take that out. Okay. And 38, I should just be able to use a Quincy ability when all this junk comes up here. Let's just get rid of that. Nice. And we'll have a Quincy ability up for 40, of course. Also might be able to buy an upgrade there. Okay. Stacks up to 40. Yeah, I can stack Stim, but... I, th no, not Stim. AMD, but that wouldn't really do anything for me. Let's see why it would. Um, Let's get Splatter. I 
So I feel like this glue spot's a bit too high. I could just do like a glue hose a bit like lower down on the line. Glue hose is really cheap. That did get a price buff at some point, I believe. So I remember before it was like 3k. Now it's like... I don't really want to get double guns. though, Because double guns can steal quite a few pops. Let's also try... Oh, drums. I never got drums, right? What am I doing? Let's see. Can I buy drums after splatter? Did I just never try getting drums? This may not work still. Um. Jeez, I never tried getting drums. What am I doing? Okay. Anyways, let's see. Without any help, how's around 40? Round 40 gets taken out. Okay, we should be in a better place now. Let's keep this heli back here. And I'm not sure if I'm going to want to be getting a hose at some point. Probably I will need a hose. So let me... Let's do this. Also, the question of camos. Because glues without camos are also kind of tricky. So, let's do this. Double discount be worth it. And then, we got, oh, I didn't even buy the camo. Okay. Um, yeah, I want, I want the ability up for, for 63. No, not 63. <laughs> what am I saying? 43. So, let's go like this. So that will increase the range. Uh, I don't think it's really that bad. Can I? No, I can't. All right. I think this is where my foam comes in play finally. I've been trying to buy this so many times. And I never got it. So I think it comes in now. Yeah. All right. Foam it up. I might not have to buy... I don't want to buy a, a camo village because camo village kind of stinks. So we'll have you on first. I need to use level three ability. There we go. Take that out. Quincy, you better, better get doing some good damage because I kind of want good damage at some point here. Okay. Well, there's my glue hose and then relentless glue. Or it might just stay at Moab glue. I don't know. Guho should be able to take out a lot. I also could get primary training to give these guys a little bit of oomph. And I also want overclock before the save up. Okay. Sneezing. Anyways, ability here. Take all that junk out. Ooh. Okay, if I can get overclock early, that just would be nice because you'd have full uptime on OC all the way until round level 20, which by that time we should just be good. Uh, so I think I can use I can use the ability at the beginning of 48, right? I'd get it back for the ceramics on 49, I think. Actually, I don't know. We'll see. The ceramics don't come out later on, until later on 49. So yeah, this should just be fine. Actually, is this fine? I don't think this is fine. All right, this is kind of bad. Oopsie daisy. All right, I need downdraft. <laughs> Yeah, I might have screwed up a little bit. That happens, though. All right, downdraft, you're going to be pushing these guys back for now. And then you come and clean up. Actually, this is quite bad. Okay. Can we clean this all up? And also take out the regrows. 
without creating a regrow farm. There we go. All right, and then we might need, yeah, I definitely will need Moab glue here. Okay, so my, I guess that was inevitable. The overclock is unfortunately delayed. Sometimes it just happens, I guess. All right, if I get Relentless Glue way earlier here, will that help out a bit? It might. It looks like it is. Okay, and I get stuns on the mob. Nice. And I can downdraft them. Okay, there we go. Easy. At the cost of a lot of pops. Also, the glues can hit the hit the camos once they get there. Okay. Now I have level 10. That that will help things out. Uh, so I will be getting some more good levels soon, too. So I don't want to have downdraft in play too much because it will steal pops. But I'll need it to like kind of get in there and push back the ceramics when that comes up. Because ceramics are annoying. Also, these lone Moabs are a bit tough too because there's nothing to trigger the relentless glue do I need yeah I might need storm of arrows for that okay am I level three up too also if there are tough rounds coming up like in between I can stall out for abilities on the next section okay 54 here this isn't looking good. Let's see what I can do here. I have downdraft up early and then use level three maybe about there. Oh, I won't serve my gut by. If I use downdraft a little late, I can get both of the Moabs with it. So about there. I didn't really use its pierce well to get the ceramics, which I also kind of need. Okay, kind of a bizarre addition, but it doesn't take pops, and I do, and it will be, I guess, the clear of the ceramics. So I have a glue strike when need be, and I can use it, and it will give me a damage buff, and I also can use that there. 56 shouldn't be an issue. But again, that overclock is once again delayed, which isn't good. I want to delay this or stall this mob out a bit. Okay, that got stalled out very nice and easy. I am racking up a lot of pops though, which isn't good. So let's use level three. Yeah. I have to have downdraft here. Level three. Oh wait, I didn't even use level three. Okay, we'll do level 10. And then level three. Now 58's here. Oh, I should have stalled that. Jeez, I'm stupid. I think with everything being so delayed, it should be fine. And also I got new Quincy levels. Yeah, it's good. Oh, Quincy is level 11 right now. I think I have to use that glue strike right about now. Oh, what about this one? Okay, we got that. One up here. Last one and take it out. Okay, 
Heli is racking up a ton of pops though, which is not nice. Still nowhere close to what the limit is, but it's still quite a few, which isn't cool. Can I take that out, please? There we go. Ooh, overclock's coming soon, though. Okay, let's do this. I need to stall this out. So, let's try using the level 3 and then level 10 about like now. Okay. There we go. Got our abilities back. And I can grab... Okay, I can also grab overclock later. So let's go... Nah. Alright, so I have to use this about now. And then level 3... I can get overclock and the level 10 somewhere. Actually, I don't really have, I'm just barely out of money for it. Hmm, hello Ryan, YouTube YT46, I don't know if that's YouTube, maybe. Okay, this should be possible, might take a handful of tries. It actually was really close that one try though. So I definitely need to use level 3 as early as possible. So you should be on strong. Yep. Level 3 is down. Okay. I think Os no, strike after that one Moab. Okay. I think that might be the solution. So you strike to pop Moab number 1. And then level three to pop mob number two and so forth. But the balloons are still a bit of an issue. Is this it? Is this it? This is quite promising. All right. Well, we got overclock with like a bajillion pops stolen. And we also have abilities for all waves of 63 with this. I just need to beat, uh, beat round 62. Shouldn't be too hard. I think I can use my level 3 for the end of this because I only need level 3 for the end of 63. And also, I probably could stall this out. There we go. So that I can use like glue strike first wave. Uh, maybe a little bit later when it comes in. Okay. Well, glue strike takes out one takes out one wave. Storm of Errors takes out wave two. Oh, but now I don't have. Oh wait, I have glue strike back up for wave three. Does that take it out? Okay, take out wave one. Wave two is easy. Now wave three is the tricky one. Glue strike really is helping out a lot, though. I must say. Okay, so use it about there, and then just 
just get stuff back. I can't use level 3. I need that on 64. Okay. Got it. Nice. And now... Bash all these guys up. There we go. Good, good, good. Okay, now we're at least past Rosalia. And that save up into Pebrew, I, I really don't know about that one. Because Pebrew is expensive, and we are, I am really struggling a lot. I wonder if it's just going to be better to get AZ. Because I, 51k, that's so much. I'd be getting it in the 80s with this, and I don't really know if my leveling is going to be enough to really push through that. Because, like, even here, I'm kind of struggling without constant ability use. And that's just, like, on ceramics and stuff. So, I guess it's going to be AZ first. And let's get to that it's just so much micro i have to do to be every round and i'm not even sure if i'm gonna make the two mega pops because 7k so far and i'm gonna need to have this guy coming in to clean up a lot of this junk here at least around 69 shouldn't be an issue can level three that hey look it goes down also buying mib at some point probably will be needed If we're doing this, we do we do CTA with AZ. So let's keep that in mind. In fact, I wonder if uh, AZ is probably first is most necessary. Four and three. That doesn't get everything. Well, If I go three and then four right after. No. What's AZ? AZ is absolute zero. It's extremely strong in two mega pops. So now that I realize I am not going to be able to get P-Brew, I think we're going to be going for that next. So let's actually purchase it right now. Well, we can't buy the whole thing, but I can buy ice which is good that would be a 250 so I need 12k I guess now 11k more for it but yeah it's easy time oh that's the wrong one why is OC the first ability now kind of odd uh, definitely ability here Okay. I'm pushing through, but now we got the tough rounds coming up. So 75's hard. Even <laughs> this one ceramic skin by. So we got that. I need to save that level 10. Either that or I can do clue storm. Hmm. Actually I might be able to get by with that if I can save and the snowstorm for round 76. Okay, so how about now? Use all of these at once. You can take out that wave instantly and push through a lot of this wave with just the ability, leaving me back with one very stunned BFB. It, it just goes straight into, um, what you call it, pinks there, though, and it pushes through. Maybe just a bunch of RNG on it. Why was that one so bad? Actually, wait, no, this is good. This is good. It's just that I have nothing to stun. Unless... Okay. 
just gonna get so many pops. So let's do that. Use it later. Do I need to use level three? I might have to use level three. That's fine. It can be stalled out. Actually, it isn't, but I think this is all right. Pop count 10K on you. You really have to have like nothing in the late game, but I think that will be all right because it is a hero. So we get more power just through levels. Um, I can't do that because I need level 10 for 78. And then after that, I'm going to have AZ. So that's going to be huge. That will be huge. So I like how we can beat mobs without having to bring in a uh, downdraft now. I remember when every moab had to have downdraft on it. Okay, let's use that and glue strike. Ooh, not the greatest. Wonder if I can get away with a stall using level ten. Good. There we go. Hey, and I can get AZ now. All right, so we got AZ. Uh, that helps out a lot. I think I can lock my heli in place here now. Is it finally time we can do that? Because I can just AZ stuff, and that's going to steal less than uh, having to downdraft. Okay, that's good. Good to note. Now, what's next? It's probably CTA. And this round is giving me troubles. Do 79. Okay, so let's... Well, I probably should use Glyke first, because Glyke comes back extremely fast. Oh, okay. So let's use Glyke... Let's do that, let's do that, and then when that's up, we can use level 3, and we have AZ again. I also probably need downdraft. So I will actually afford MIB later in the round. Okay, let's take that out, get that, I guess I can hover over MIB for sake of that. So after that storm of arrows, MIB actually can be bought, which is pretty cool. All right, Glyke up now. Can I buy it, please? There we go. Okay, there we go. We got MIB. And now my Mac is low on battery, so I gotta plug it in. And now I'm at a weird angle. <laughs> Let's put that back. Alright. Can I now finally have heli in the back let's see okay why you don't salvage more runs uh I don't have like the list of runs to salvage if I feel like if I asked my audience I'd just get a bunch of like list map stuff which I don't want to do I could try asking Isab for like the list itself, but I don't think he'd give it to me. 
All right, so this, this is probably just quite an ability spam. So it is time, I guess, to spameth the abilities, mainly a lot of absolute zero. So do I want, I think I want CTA up before glue storm. Oh wait, we don't have cooldown. Or trees down. Let's get that. Like try the runs he didn't beat. Uh, I could do that, but I feel like that would just get like stale and piggybacky type. I did make one video about it. But that's kind of the extent of it. Okay, so when these guys break down, they're a bit of an issue. So, do I have to use that? I do have to use that there. It's kind of annoying. I'll just get level 3 up. Take out the last one. There we go. So, pop count... Ooh, our pops aren't really looking the hottest right now. Hope you're doing good. I'm in a, the more chill part, I guess, if this looks stressful. <laughs> you might want to imagine what the rounds before this looked like, because those were the, the stressful rounds. This is the chill area. Just kind of sit back and hit random abilities and beat the rounds. But yep, yeah, if you want a pop count check, we've got 11k on you, nearly 1k, 7k on you, 1.5k on you. What does foam have? Oh, yeah. Foam has a lot. That's why I don't want to get double guns, because if I got that, it would be like double of that. <laughs> but anyways, I got CTA now, so look at this neat trick. Shredded. Wow. And also I have AZ. So hello, bear, teddy bear. Oh, your name looks like teddy bear, so that's what I was going to say. Okay. So, yep, we're doing pretty well. Can use any abilities I really need. And I have AZ, so I can just AZ all this stuff up. Oh, I accidentally used CTA instead of... AC. That's alright. Should be just fine. So we do have level 19 now. So the one annoying thing about level 20 is that I won't have full uptime on OC. So it might be a good idea to just get two overclocks. Which is a bit annoying. So let's just... Let's just pop that. That will also be the beginning of 89. And then I can start uh, spamming AZ again. Very creative name. Yeah, it's pronounced Teddy Bear. Neat. Okay. So now, what is our DDT? We might need some Sabos. Sabos are always good. Um, I could get Glue Storm too. Or I could just go for that. Uh... But DDT seem like they aren't really that bad. So it might be Glue Storm next. Or second Sabo. The only thing is that Glue Storm kind of does interfere uh, with AZ a lot, but I just bought it. Now my abilities got shifted around, so now AZ's four. Look at that. So I just can't use Glue Storm with AZ, which is, again, a little annoying, but we can live with that. Okay, well, anyways, we got Permafrost on ZUMG, so let's go for five. Glue Storm... Those ZMGs are a little out of range. That's okay, I guess. 93 is not really going to be an issue, I don't think. 
Can we still beat this up? Let's just use CTA here. Okay. I can just AZ all these guys at once. So look, they're done. They are done. And level three will clear it out. Okay, so we're, we're, we're doing good. We're doing good now. Not getting pops on any other guys. AZ, I guess, gets a few. But that's what AZ does. We can use all our abilities. So let's just, like, wait for all this stuff to come out and smash it up. Ha, <laughs> that's fun. We'll see that in action on 98. But yeah, as long as we don't use AZ when the glue storm is active, we, sh we should be fine. So I could get another Sabo. Well, I mean, I could get Sabos or I could get the other OC. I don't know. We'll have options. Let's see. So let's do that. Let's AZ. And let me glue storm and level three. Does this just take it all out? Uh, yeah, it should. There we go. Okay. So let's do that. Let me... Use that there. Glorm CTA. Glorm's going to be done about now. So I can use that, and then I can use level 3. Ah, okay. Something leaked there. This should be good. What was the round six start here? Oh, yeah, Dart NG. That does indeed work. If you didn't know. Okay. So can we wait for Glorm to be down? And then I can do that. Let's use level three now. And use some more AZ. And then this should deal with the rest of this. There we go. 97, we can just spam AZ until they come up. I have so much cash left over. Look at me go. I mean, it's good to save it, I guess. Um, buying a Sabo probably would be a worthy purchase, but I also, it's good to have a lot of cash spare on 100, because if you can go for, like, a Super Brittle, that just would shred 100. Okay. Actually, I probably don't want to use level 10. Um, yeah, let's just leak here. We can use the abilities that will will come back quickly and I can use sab uh no not sab OC now so let's go one last easy and then level three glue storm there we go those guys will come back later anyways and now we need a bunch of you Good there. Okay. Alright, shred it up. It's not doing as much damage as I would have liked, to be honest. We got everything but the ZOMGs, which isn't the greatest. We might need some Sabos. Some Sabo, I'm going to say a Sabo. Strange magic, indeed. Okay, so let's use all of this right now. Keep the AZ up. Alright, I'm going to move you a little closer. Nice. Triple FS100. 
Uh, I'm thinking it might be too Sabo play. I should still have enough to really do whatever I would need to do, right? I do have Glorm. I mean, Glorm makes things easier because it's debuffs. Oh, that was too early. Oopsie daisy. Oh, I get OC back up anyways. I can get another Sabo. Okay. Just Sabo that. Okay, I can use more than just one Sabo. That's all right. Uh, I probably want to AZ earlier and then use that. Oh, wrong thing. Wrong buttons. I, well, I clicked the right buttons in the wrong order. That definitely wasn't the right thing. I also could just try using a CTA like uberly early. Let's try that. So if I just use like CTA at the start of the round. That works, I guess. Yeah, and then I, I'll have CTA up. And now, how much, what do I deal to 100? What's my round 100 damage based on Quincy alone like? Pretty bad. So we gotta kinda take out the round 100 layer. And to do that, I'm thinking tax. Well, first of all, we can get Embrit. To give more damage to Quincy itself. And we can do taxes are. That's the wrong thing. Perhaps that. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Look, I died. Jeez. First of all, let's let's clear this. Cuz I don't need that in the way. Okay. There we go. We did it. Okay. Yay. Quincy 2 Mega Pop. 7k spare, which in all terms is fairly close. Um, pop count seal. 1.6k on AZ. 8.2k on overclock. 11k on downdraft. Downdraft was... Oof, stole a lot. Um, Alk took 2.2k, and the tax did about 10k to round 100. And then Quincy did everything else. Also, hello, Freds. Thank you. Uh, I was wondering when the victory screen had reloaded around on it. Uh, that happened a few updates ago. I think it was like 42.0. 203 sub 2 mega pop. Still more crack than this. Did somebody do 203 on... Dark Castle? 
Just wondering. If so, that would be pretty cool. Oh, you got an ad at the end. That's unfortunate. Oh, well, you'll see it in the video. Oh, uh, but yeah, that was something. Whew. Okay, well, I guess Quincy's just that good. Quincy's that good, you could say. Anyways, that was a long run. Thanks for watching. If you want to help out the channel, you can check out these new videos, like and subscribe for more content, support the channel by becoming a member, and joining the Discord to chat with the community. Bye!